Welcome back to remote learning lesson number two. We are going to be talking about finding the least common multiple. This is a continuation off the greatest common factor, and we're going to use the example that you did in the previous lesson. So yesterday, with the greatest common factor, we multiplied the two numbers on the left-hand side of the ladder. Today, we are finding the greatest or the least common multiple. Instead of creating our G, all I'm going to do is circle all of the numbers, creating an L for least common multiple, and then I'm going to multiply these four numbers together. So I have 2 times 4 times 2 times 3. Okay, one at a time. 2 times 4 is 8 times by 2 times by 3. Remember, we're creating that tornado to get down to one number. 8 times 2 is 16. And then 16 times 3. Man, I can't do that in my head, so off to the side. I'm going to do 16 times by 3. 6 times 3 is 18. Carrying the 1, 3 times 1 is 3, plus 1 is 4, to get our least common multiple of 16 and 24, 48. If you need another example on the resource that we have provided you, they are listing out the factors or the multiples of each number, and you are selecting the one that they share that is the least. Stay tuned for remote learning lesson number 3. See you tomorrow.